Okay, just moved into a new house today and the previous owners left us some stuff in boxes. And I opened one of the boxes today and lo and behold, looky what I found to go on the wall. Yeah, a bunch of die cast cars. Now, most of these are Maisto. Some of them are off brand. I have no idea of what kind of brand they are. And to be honest with you, without a little bit of research, there's a couple of these cars that, you know, I look at them and I say, oh, okay, that's, that's a so-and-so car. But in terms of the exact year, that sort of thing, I honestly don't know at the moment. So I'm gonna go through one by one and review them for you real quick. All right, let's zoom in. There's one that I really like, the bike. I've always been a big fan of the two-stroke CRs from Honda. So, I ordered these somewhat in order of the year they were sold. And let's go to the first one. I think this is a 48 Ford pickup truck. Pretty nice. I think that was a Maisto. Next, we've got a 53 Chevy Corvette. Very nice. I think that's a Maisto as well. I'm not certain. Once again, there's a lot of different brands here. Most of them are Maisto. Got the exact same car, looks like. Again, why she had two of them, I don't know. Then, we got the one I really like, the Porsche 550 Spider, AKA James Dean machine. Then we've got a, what is that would be? Like a 60, does it say Hot 57? Okay, Hot 57, so I guess that would be a 57 Chevy Corvette. Very nice with the red interior. All right, coming on down. We've got a split window. I think the split window on the vet was, what was that, 63? It is a split window. You can see it is a split window there. And then coming on over, we've got a Camaro SS. No idea what, what year that car is, but nice convertible. Then we've got an El Camino. I think that's a 69 El Camino. And that, I'm not enamored with wheels on that. So, excuse me, that's a 1970. Why it has 1970 on the door, I don't know, but it does. The doors do open. And if you can see it, it does have 1970 on there. Coming on down to the next row. That's a Pontiac GTO, right? Am I correct? Okay, got the bike again. Coming on over, Ford Torino. I like this Ford Torino, that's a nice looking car. Coming on down to the fourth row, and we've got, is that a Testarossa? Then we got a racing Testarossa from approximately the same year. Now, could that be like a, a 358? Is there a 358 in a Ferrari? Mm. Feel free to correct me. Then we got the racing Ferrari. We've got a pickup truck. That's a Maisto. Pretty sure that's a Maisto. Got a Corvette. Is that a C5 or a C6? I'm thinking C6, okay? I'm just not a Corvette fan, so hard for me to tell. Zoom in a little bit for you so you can look at it there. Pretty beat up, looks like some kids have been playing with it. It's got dust all over it. It's a lot more red than the camera is making it right now. Coming on down, one of my absolute favorites, 993 Porsche from the mid 90s to about 97, 98 that made that car. We got a Mercedes sedan. No idea what year that was, what model it is, none of that. PT Cruiser. I don't see the point in having a model of that, but okay. No idea what year that is. No idea if it's a Maisto, no idea. And then we got a BMW Z8. And then we've got a Dale Earnhardt Jr. Jr. Excuse me, Dale Earnhardt Jr. Monte Carlo, I believe that is. Pretty cool. So yeah, she left me a lot of cars.
I was very pleased to see that when my wife brought that out of the cabinet and hope you enjoyed that little new